The R12i is the latest generation of GNSS receiver from Trimble. This is the first Trimble receiver to feature the Trimble Inertia platform, known as TIP. The R12i has a built-in inertial measurement unit that allows for the measurement to be taken without the rod being plumb. This allows the user to locate hard to access points and stay out of harm's way. The user watches the rod tip and not the level vial. The compensation is built in, calibration free and immune to magnetic interference. The inertial measurement unit is available while measuring topo points, rapid points and during stakeout. The R12i will work with a radio correction, VRS correction such as Whiskors, or satellite-based correction like Trimble RTX. Built-in automatic integrity modeling ensures data accuracy. It is recommended that a fixed range pole is used for the R12i to help eliminate any pole error. If you are using an adjustable pole, a pole bias compensation can be performed to help eliminate pole deflection. In the past, hard to reach structures such as pipe inverts needed multiple measurements and hand calculations. They now can be captured with a single measurement. Structures that were hard to get plumb measurements on, such as retaining walls, light poles, and fire hydrants, can now be located easily. The R12i continues to incorporate ProPoint technology, which has been available on the R10 Model 2 and R12. ProPoint helps with taking measurements in challenging or hostile GNSS environments. Satellite signals from all constellations are considered equal. This flexible satellite signal management allows for faster initialization times and more reliability in difficult environments such as under tree cover or near buildings. The R12i works with Windows 10, Android, and iOS operating systems and will work with the TSC7, TDC600, T7, and T10 tablets. Trimble Access 2020.10 and higher is required. When starting a survey, select the R12i survey style and start your survey as normal. Notice the face LED panel is displayed. This means that the face of the R12i should be toward the user. You will notice in the status bar at the top of the screen that the precisions include RTK and the IMU. The IMU needs motion for the precisions to be displayed. As soon as the receiver is moved, you will see your precisions. Tap on the new receiver icon for the R12i and go into the GNSS functions. IMU tilt compensation is now an option. You can turn this off at any time. The GNS receiver icon will change to an R10 or R12i and the digital bubble will appear. Turning the IMU compensation back on, you will need to move the R12i to wake up the IMU. After taking a measurement, review the point. The device orientation is displayed and the values are applied to the GNSS position. For more information on the R12i or to request a demo, please contact us at Siler Instrument.